Alright, I'm going to show you guys how I adjust the carburetor. And what I got here is an old school vacuum gauge. I just look for a port. Any one of these ports, uh, you want one that has constant vacuum on it. One that doesn't uh, change when you rev it up. You gotta find the vacuum port that does that, and then put your vacuum gauge on there. And you adjust these screws over here. You adjust them until you get the most, until you get the highest amount of vacuum you could get. That, that's, that's your goal. You want to try and get the highest amount of vacuum you could get. You gotta adjust them and wait a little while so the, the vacuum. Uh, Respond. You gotta give it some time to respond. That seems already a little better than when we started. I like to go in and tighten the screws in, which will make it lean, until I can get the highest possible amount of vacuum, and then if you're going too lean, the vacuum will start to go down again. So I like to go where you got the highest amount of vacuum, and then back off, go counterclockwise just a little bit, just a hair. That seems to run the best for me.